Hi, Matt Byer of Matt Byer Organizing. And I want to talk about how disorganized people are amazing. One of the things I always tell folks I meet is it's our job to make space, not judgments. Clearing a path forward is my life's work and I have no space for being judgmental. But my clients are often very judgmental of themselves. The number one consultation question I get is, is this the worst you've ever seen? I also get, what's wrong with me? I'm overwhelmed. Am I hopeless? Like I said, I don't judge. But if I did judge, I would say to all disorganized people out there, you're not hopeless. You're amazing. Now, this is not to say that organized people are not amazing. We are. And I'm not going to get into all the reasons why disorganized people find organizing so difficult. I just want to share some tendencies we see in our clients that make them amazing. Number one, disorganized people are often very creative and imaginative, so much so that they are coming up with more projects than they can process, let alone put away. Number two, disorganized people are often very smart and successful. Our clients are well-educated, brilliant, and hardworking. We work with doctors, lawyers, engineers, and all kinds of different professions. No surprise that organizing doesn't rise to the top of their priority lists. Number three, disorganized people are loving. The day in, day out challenge of raising a family who is loved, protected, and provided for inevitably calls for sacrifices. If the organizing has to take a back seat, that's okay. Ultimately, sustainable organizing comes from recognizing your top priorities and because you do, you're closer than you think. Same applies to your fur family. Number four, disorganized people are generous. You don't limit your shopping to yourself. You're always thinking of others and what they would like. You buy things when you think of friends and family, not just for holidays and birthdays. Number five, disorganized people are often very resourceful and highly principled. You hate to see good things go to waste. You're always looking for creative ways to repurpose items you don't otherwise need. You care about the Earth's limited resources and you don't want to be selfish. My dad, a child of the Depression, was like this. I often hear his voice in my head as I recommend a clear, lucite, petroleum-based container to organize your snacks. And number six, disorganized people are often very joyful and optimistic. You can be the most joyful, optimistic, and positive person but still carry a burden of shame under your burden of clutter. That was my mother. Her friends remember her as one of the nicest people they ever met. Me too. Disorganized people are such great, amazing people that I hate to see them getting down on themselves. Just because you're amazing doesn't mean you need the stress of clutter. Your time should be used for things that are worthy of your talents. Whether it comes from a friend, my team, or another professional organizer, be sure to seek the organizing help you need. Because you're not hopeless, you're amazing. For more easy organizing tips, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around.